What's your advice for people who are stuck in a negative cycle, right? Once they understand this, people who are positive in nature, they keep on growing. But at the same time, this this law that there is, it also takes someone in a downward spiral who don't understand this. So for someone who is stuck there in mm -hmm. a lot of negativity, what would you advise them to do? I think the first thing is to remember that in every moment, every moment, all you can just shift. Um, I uh, teach a process. It's, it's so simple. It's just stop, pivot, focus, feel. Right. So mm -hmm. it's just a, I okay. Realizing I'm 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 feeling negative. I just need to stop. And so um, now I want to stop realizing this and then I want to pivot and focus on the really positive things or the thing that I want, right? Or just even something that's more neutral. And so, and then you focus on that and then you feel so, and you feel it's like, okay, yeah, that would be really good. Or it just, I've just shifted. I've just, I'm shifted into a, just a neutrality. It, even if you just do that, it's so much better. But, um, but if we can just, um, so if we just know that in any moment we can change the course of our actions, every choice is like a, another uh, movement towards the, the, the uh, timeline that, that we're wanting to move towards or the reality that we're wanting to move towards. Um, I have a process also, people are really negative and there's just like this, there, there can have been um, an energy of our beliefs or our stories that we've been telling ourselves for a very long time that gets stuck in our field. And so that's kind of one of my, um, oh, it's one of my superpowers is really just being able to um, go in and, and and shift and change that that energy and release yeah. it. So I could, it's, a, it's a frequency release and activation. Um, so I release that frequency of that, that energy that's in their field and then um, activate the one that they actually truly want to have instead. Uh, but, really the the for people who are just feeling negative and um and feel like oh i'm just going i'm spiraling down just remember in any moment you can stop and just you know listen to something that inspires you with or you know do something that just you really like to do or um yeah i mean you know or just um play some music or you know hang out with friends being gratitude. I mean, as soon as you can get into that state of just of, of gratitude, the frequency of gratitude and, and, and just being thankful for the things that you do have that are really, that are good. And sometimes it's a stretch, right? For some people that's yeah. just like, oh, I like my life is such crap. I, there's nothing I, yeah. you know, I don't, I can't be grateful for anything, right? That's not true. Um, and so it's, there's something, right? You have some yeah. things, there are some people yeah. around you that, um, that care about you. Um, yeah. and regardless, the sun is going to come up today. So that's, that's really, you know, be grateful for yeah. that. Right. So, yeah. <laughs> yeah. And, uh, the biggest challenge, right. For most people and even what I faced was not understanding this. Like, of course, when we read it, we understand this, but to maintain a frequency which is different than our default frequency, whether it is for a person who is stuck in a negative cycle, of course, at momentarily they can pivot, but then maintaining that positivity or maintaining that frequency throughout the day, how can one do it? Recently, I, I think... Uh... Uh, there's a there's a process uh, it's a centering um, uh, exercise that I think is really really powerful where you just you become aware of uh, you just come into the present moment and really yeah. the moment that you can do that the more you can center yourself and then connect to me I, I add that in it's a uh, it's a self inquiry process too and um, I kind of I put those two together on, on an ongoing basis where it's just I center is like okay I'm, I'm being aware of my thoughts i am um being aware of my you know what's going on around me i'm feeling of how i'm feeling in my body and just again very very much getting into the into the uh, the present moment and then there's the thoughts or the thinker of the thoughts and then the observer and so um and witness I, I, yeah. what's that uh, we call it in vedanta we call it witness who is oh, witnessing okay. everything yeah, yeah. Right. Yes. Witnessing. Yes. Um, yeah. So when you're witnessing and and 
then just stopping and say, okay, so what's the next thought? And this is the thing that I think is so very cool. Cause when you say, you know, what's the next thought? It's just like, everything kind of goes blank, which makes me really think maybe we are AI. <laughs> Cause it's, I think we're, I think we're constantly being prompted by our, our outer world. And so, um, and then we're, you know, that creates all these thoughts. But if, if we stop, it's like, okay, what's the no next thought? There's your moment you know mm -hmm. for a moment or maybe a few moments and, and if you can practice it for longer that's kind of almost where you can get to that start yeah. to access that zero point or at least neutrality and then from there the next step is who are you and who am i and to me it's like i am right so yeah. when you get to that state it's just like oh i am and and you're accessing your power you're accessing source you're connecting to source from there it's it's um very powerful but if you just do the centering where you're just getting present and you can do that once an hour for you know during yeah. waking hours changes everything yeah i i found this in uh before this i found this in reality transurfing the mm -hmm. centering method yeah yeah he, he talks about watching your inner screen and the outer screen so okay. what what is happening inside and what is happening outside and then yeah. you'll come to the stillness. If you like the video, check out this next and make sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel for more content like this. Thank you and welcome to our community.